Welcome back, one and all, to Trails of Cold Steel. I am the Dark Seraph. Last time, the game dropped a fucking bomb on us. Crow is Comrade C, leader of the Imperial Liberation Front. He has fought, he has murdered Chancellor Osborne and has started a civil war across Arabonia. Class 7 has led an assault into the into Trista to put a stop to whatever's going on in there. And that's just what we're going to do. I'm taking with me Eusis, B, Elliot, Milliam, Laura, and Elise, and let's take Gaius. No, not, not, not guys. We're gonna take Elisa with us. Yes. We have to do any current preparation. I'm gonna remove her bunny ears and... I'm going to remove any of the cosmetics on them just because this is going to be story important heavy stuff. We're going to re-equip everybody's quartz. Well, actually, you've got pretty good stuff. And I like how you're set up. Golden Bell. Go at more HP. A little evasion will help you. Get the roll on you. Cross Crusade. He seems to be a very holy character. That gives you a lot of decent stuff. I don't even know what I'm looking at here. That also gives you some good stuff. I like the way how you're set up. I like how you're set up. Here, you need a couple of things. Good to have a defensive buff. Yes, Lore is with me. You have nothing equipped. I want to keep you keep shield three. No, 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 no. There we go. Attack three. Purgatorial flame. Volcanic rain. Dallas uh, could be useful. 
I want you to have plenty of movement. Elisa, yeah, you're just fine. Sleep. Yeah, that's pretty annoying shit. That needs to go on, Elisa. Kick his ass. Let's do it. No, I hit the wrong button. May Adios be with you. And just a little speculation from me, but looking at their design, you should aim for their joints. Take them apart at their weakest points and you might have a chance. I see. Then let's pray our aim is true. The joint is the weakest part on basically everything. I, I know I'm repeating myself at this point, but don't go doing anything crazy. You hear? Oh, so I shouldn't go charging out into a field with intent to destroy mechanized death bots. Still, I know in my heart how much you want to protect this school. What I'm saying is this whole... This is just crazy in general. So do what you think you have to do. Not just for us, but so that whatever ends up happening, you'll know you gave the best you had to give. That's good. Waste any time. It seems the battle's already underway. There. Oh, shit. Toward the west exit. Let's move. If 
by the divine. Impossible. The provincial arm. What's a provincial army doing fighting these things? You're loyal to the nobles. Are you even human? Oh. Oh, I'm as human as they come. Can't speak for the principal, though. <laughs> or Instructor Beatrix, for that matter. I'll say. Our decorated veterans are putting the younger generation to shame. Now, now. There's no need to go around flattering old ladies, Nightheart. Ha. No need to be so modest, Beatrix. That's interesting. Van Dyke fights with a gun dowel. I don't know of any other old ladies who could reduce an armored car to a smoldering wreck that quickly. <laughs> Says the man who cut one in half. <laughs> Always nice to share a little outing Two with my staff wonderful users, colleagues. A sniper and a guy using a gun dow. And while we're at it, since when were the two of you such whizzes with all those high-level arts? Especially you, Thomas. When did you leave the library long enough to become so disturbingly proficient with an orbital staff? <laughs> well, you know me. I've always been rather taken with the mages of the Middle Ages. Th they're monsters! Sir, we don't stand a chance against them! Ah, stop your whining! This? By themselves? I almost feel sorry for the soldiers. I don't. Um, just who is Instructor Beatrix? She was a field medic. She was a colonel in the Imperial Army. They used to call her the Reviver. Heard she saved Sarah's life once even. Yeah, she's kind of a legend. In her days with the Medical Corps, she'd show up in war zones to treat the critically injured. She'd patch them all up. Friend or foe, and woe to anyone or anything who tried to stop her. Well, those foes you patched up were probably prisoners of war. Hmm. Wow, no wonder she's so unflappable. Well, black star there. You know, maybe they don't need our help after all. No, it's not over yet. It looks like they've got some reinforcements coming in. Cease your fire! There's no need to increase our casualties any further. If they're fielding monsters, we might as well call in our own. <laughs> Here they come. That's an interesting blade Nightheart has. My, <laughs> they've certainly brought quite a few of those. They're boasting some impressive armor. It looks like they've been designed with integrated arts resistance, too. Hmm. What to do, what to do? You think we can really beat all these things? Well, I don't see another way out of this, do you? We need to hold this location until the Imperial Army's reinforcements arrive, no matter what. <laughs> Time to see if the Army's finest up-and-coming officer has it where it counts. Same to you, Miss A-Rank Bracer. My, my! You two really do make quite the dynamic duo. I mean, you have a soldier and a Minuteman. What do you expect? Shut, Shut up, up, Thomas! Thomas. <laughs> All right. Palestine and Nightheart are taking point. Let's give them some cover. Shouldn't you be up there with them, Mr. Gundow? Yes, sir. Now. Let's see which parts have that arts resistance shield. They certainly seem to be holding their own. Yeah, but look how many they're up against. And the enemy's still got strength to spare. But the instructors don't have anything to fall back on if the enemy gets the upper hand. Let's go. They need backup, and we're here to give it to them. Right. I'm not sure how much support we'll be able to provide them. At the very least, we should be able to keep one of those things busy. If we can give them that much more of a fighting chance, I'll do it. <laughs> that won't be necessary. Sharon? 
What? Sharon? Allow me to handle things here. I'll be sure to give Lady Sarah and her colleagues the opening they need to clinch their victory. Huh? She's the severing chain. She's fast. I figured you'd show up sooner or later. Oh my! Steel wires. These new model engines certainly are quite the step up. I'm impressed. Still, all the power in the world doesn't mean much if you're all tied up. The pleasure of being bound, vulnerable, and exposed is a thrill like no other. Oh, you're a bit of a sadist, aren't you? Would you care for a little demonstration? I'd say you won't feel a thing, but that would be lying. <laughs> So you finally dropped the act, huh? Looks like you've even picked up a few new tricks since our little dust-up two years ago. But I guess I wouldn't expect any less from Sharon Kruger, Ouroboros' enforcer number nine. Oh, Ouroboros. Or should I just call you the Severing Chain? I'm currently on leave from that position. Right now, I'm but a humble maid in the service of the Reinford family. But you're a humble maid who happens to be quite proficient at killing. And no matter who's pulling the strings, anyone who tries to harm Lady Elisa or her friends will have to get through me first. That's fine by me. But I think you and I need to sit down and have a nice long talk after all this is over. I'll bring the snacks. Oh, look at them go! Are you just going to stand there and let the ladies run laps around you, Major? Of course not. I was just about to say we should focus our assault on one and hit it with everything we've got. Boys will be boys. <laughs> oh my. I feel like a mere mortal walking among titans. Okay, I think I have these guys figured out. Gonna nullify their hardship capabilities. Who's this Makarov guy? I don't recognize him. He wasn't in much. He at all. <laughs> you sure know how to show a guy a good time. Vulcan. Huh. You got some real fight in you. I can respect that. Still, there's only so much you can do against these soul dots. Let's see how long you can hold out, shall we? Didn't mean to cut him off, sorry. I'm guessing I'm gonna be fighting that Your one. military academy. Let's see how much fight you've really got in you. So, Elisa, just who the heck is Sharon? Don't ask me! I want to know just as much as the rest of you! I'm pretty sure my mother knows her background, but she never told me. Still, now they may have at least a chance of victory. Though not a great one by any stretch. Still, we've seen those suits demolish battle tanks in just a few hits. Every second we hesitate. You're right. If we joined the fight, their chances would be that much better. Sound. It's faint, but I can hear it. No way. But but that's coming from the opposite direction of the capital. Lammy! <laughs> We've got two of those armors coming in fast! A blue one and a green one! <sighs> well, they certainly don't seem to be holding back on our account. Are they trying to catch the town in a pincer attack? Probably. The instructors and Sharon have their work cut out for them with those five. Looks like we're the first and only line of defense then. Yeah. 
Get ready, everyone! Ah, uh, continue. Just as east exit in sight now. No hostiles visible. <laughs> I hear they've rounded up quite the posse to defend this little town. But I'm sure they've got their hands full dealing with Vulcan. So there's Scarlet. Never mind that, though. We're not here for the town. C's instructions were to head straight for the academy and take all of the students captive. Roger that, Comrade S. We've got a group of unknowns, dead ahead! Hmm? My, my, what have we here? <laughs> and here I thought Vulcan would get all the fun to himself. But you didn't let me down, did you, Class 7? You managed to turn up every single time. Commencing operation. Our objective is to defend Trista's east exit. Aim for the one in the front and give it everything you've got. Yes, it. <laughs> How cute. You seriously think you can beat a Soldats unit, do you? It just wouldn't be sporting of us to attack at the same time, so why don't you soften them up a little first? Roger that. With pleasure. You've interfered with our cause for far too long. It's time you got what's coming to you. Let's see how long you last against this dragon. Let's do it. Enemy sniper, take him out. Dragon soldats. Oh, this. Crafts. Noble command. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Yeah, right. yeah. My turn. Elliot is in the party. Crafts. Flash grenade. Here. Jesus! Ha! Right! Uh, resounding beat. Okay, Elliot, you're Keep it up, everyone! Keep your distance. My turn. Hmm, I think doesn't have that much health in all things, considering what I've been fighting. Here you go. Shadow Blade. I'll handle this. Know your place. Resistance. Here we go. Resistance. I was careless. You just took down my, my... goddamn. Focus activate! I'll handle this. And Reen's been blinded. I don't like that. My turn! Burn to ash! Ha! Damn it!
turn. I suppose I should thank you. This is not going to be an easy fight. Very well. Keep my composure. Come on, man. I'll handle this. Be gone! Ha! That's getting really annoying. Right! Hocus activate! Ha! Thanks. My turn. Marcus, activate! Go! My turn! Okay. Marcus, activate! Damn it! I was... I just cannot keep Fee alive. This. I don't like that damn blind status. Very well. Go. Go. My turn. Arcus, activate. Very well. Zero. Jesus. I'm gonna switch out for. Let's bring Good Laura left. in. Understood. Behold the might of the Arcade School. Radiant Blade Dance. Again. Will you stop doing that? I'm sorry, everyone. <laughs> Very well. I leave this to you. William, Come on, you're coming lady. in. Come on, lady. Time to bring the hammer down. I need my heavy hitter. That's all there is to it. Ha! 
You have my thanks. This could be bad. Arcus, activate! Ha! Thanks! My turn! Here we go! Good. Okay. Reen, I'm gonna have to have you use a healing item on Elliot. It's gonna like four bone energy. It does. Damn it. Oh, you have lifesteal now, do you? I'm not gonna complain. Huh. <laughs> Thanks. Back up! Earth, water, fire, wind. Arcus, activate! That's for you! Of course. Territorial flame. Arcus, activate! Damn it. it strong enough. My turn. Huh. You have my thanks. Why do you feel the need to keep I'm doing sorry, that? Everyone. Here I go. here. Okay, this, this is not bad. going... How are you still alive? There's no sense even trying. I'm gonna get a weekend and retry. I'm sorry, everyone. Enemies ahead! We'll have to... My turn. Now is our chance! Don't let it pass! Yeah, yeah. Keep... My turn. Arcus, activate. Yeah. My turn.
Arcus, activate. Hundred and one thousand health. This is a performance just for you. To you. I'll handle this. Let's go. Right. to every single debuff.
turn. Okay. Here we go. Right. Right. I'll handle it. Go. Okay, right. let's think about this. Maelstrom. Oh, well, I hope you can pull it off. I can do this. I'll handle it. Come on, do something stupid. Thank you so much. Go! Right there really pisses me this. off. It's my turn. 
Okay. Not good. Okay, we're gonna hold off on using that. Huh? Thanks! Until, okay. your, until its turn comes up. You're gonna do a turn steal. Not good. I know I can get this guy down. This might even be the shot to do it. That's gonna be a lot of damage. Believe in you, Elisa. Ah, oh, damn. I was careless. Here we go. Huh. My turn. Oh my god, 12 thou. You know what? I'm gonna do something a little risky. Sorry, can you handle this? Understood. Ta! Behold the might of the Arcade School! Radiant Blade Dance! Got you. God, that was hard. Damn it. How? How could I have lost to a bunch of kids? They're only students. We. We did it! That's it looks one. Like George was right about aiming for the joints. <laughs> I should have expected that C's classmates wouldn't go down easy. She's time for her turn, I guess. I recognize that grating voice. Scarlet? You're in there, aren't you? Oh, did you miss me? I'm sorry we didn't get a chance to play the mine. But I hope you haven't forgotten that I owe you for getting in my way at Corellia Fortress. You managed to be one Solox, but once is just luck. Let's see how you fare against a Spiegel. <gasps> that one's not like the others. It must be a command unit. So it has weapons the regular suits don't? Oh, believe me. You'll find that. Sadly, I doubt you'll survive the demonstration. But at least try to put up some token resistance. Good God, we're going right into it. <laughs> Come on, then. Right. My turn. Huh. My turn. Huh. My turn. Huh. How about this? Huh? It's got a barrier. Good you God. Here we go. Do I have a battle scope? Yes. Huh. It has all the same effectiveness. Just more health. Oh my God, it's level 70. My turn. You 
know, the giant mecha thing would be kind of nice. Okay. I can't, I can't touch it. My turn. This is bullshit. <laughs> That's all it's My doing turn. is reflective armor. Huh? My turn. I'll handle it. This thing's like a, it's got to be immune or something. Here we go. Is this a force loss battle? My turn. Right. I, I don't think there's anything I can do about this thing. This is my secret. We've already seen it. I don't. I think, yeah, this is just impossible. <laughs> no. Yeah, that's a forced loss. Okay, I, you know what? I'm glad that I didn't waste items or bullshit on that. No way. It reflected all our attacks. That's cheating. It really is. And this, children is what we call reactive armor. Think of it as a protective field that the pilot can activate at will. They originally designed it to defend against tank assaults, but as you can see, that's not its only use. The 5th Division really outdid itself this time. Reen? Hey, what are you... You're not. It's the same as when he fought the Viscount. No! Don't! Don't do it, Reem! <laughs> so this must be that power of yours that C mentioned. I wonder if it'll really give you the strength to take down this Spiegel. If I go full force, it'll probably cost me my life. But if that's what it takes to keep them all safe, then that's the price I'll pay. Reen, stop! You don't have to do this! Dost thou desire the power? That thing. <laughs> Do I get to be a power of one accord? A covenant can be made. Thou hast but to call out my name. One in whom dwells the flame. Awaken her. This voice. It looks like all the conditions have finally been met. Selene? Selene? You can talk? Yes, yes, quite eloquently too. But that's not important right now. <laughs> okay, Reen. You're fighting a mech with a sword, and there's a voice talking in your head. Is a talking cat really that far fetched? Right now, you need to stay focused. You should know his name already. You saw it deep within the realm of the Great Shadow. Uh. Valamir. She's right. I remember the name. It feels so familiar. Like I've always known. Valimar. Heed, Heed my call. call. The Ashen Knight! What's happening to him? 
He just stopped moving. Celine, what's going on? Shh, let him concentrate. What? Did did Celine just The cat is talking! What's he doing with that fancy light show? Why are you just standing no, there letting him do this? It's not going to save their skins this time. Playtime's over, brats. Unless you have a death wish, I suggest you get the hell out of here. Sonic Boom? What was that? Is the provincial army bombarding the town? Wait! No! Shit! Is that what C was talking about? What the? Here it comes. I am thou. Thou art I. Ashen Knight, Valimar. <gasps> Reen, how did you... Is this one of the great knights from the ancient legends? So the tales are true. You see before you one of the divine knights, incarnations of the great power. The Ashen Knight, Valimar. Ah, damn it! This wasn't in the plans. It shouldn't have been able to move yet. What a shoulda coulda. Even doing this, it's like my body just knows. The moment you accepted the Awakener's Covenant, all the fundamental knowledge was granted to you. But you've got a more pressing issue to deal with right now. And this Divine Knight doesn't have a weapon yet either. <sighs> You're mine! It's fast. It evaded that attack like a trained duelist. Like Reen would. All right, I think I figured out the basics. Reen! Is he inside that thing making it move? Yes. <laughs> That's awesome! I recognize that stance. The eight leaves one blade styles unarmed form. <laughs> You're just full of surprises, aren't you? Huh. Looks like you might be able to handle this after all. The eight leaves one blade school has a form we use if we're disarmed or have to fight without a weapon. And believe me, Master Ka Fai drilled it into me so thoroughly I could do it in my sleep. Sounds like you owe him a thank you next time you see him. Watch out! Here she comes! Let's see what we can do! <laughs> <laughs> 